we've come all this way, but we've not actually given the user the ability to log out yet, which is pretty annoying because when we want to log out when we're testing, we have to just delete our uh, session ID. So let's log into our application. And we're going to go ahead and implement our logout function or functionality. So we're logged in and we can only see home. Uh, register and login are gone. We know that. We've already seen that. But now we want a new link, which is to log out. So let's update our navigation. So let's close all of these off. And let's go and update our templates, partials, navigation. If the user is authenticated, we can now implement a new link, which is going to be to log out. So we can see that here now, log out. So we need to create a root for this. So under roots auth, we're going to create a new file called logout.php. We are going to say this is logout, create our function here, use our app, and we want to process the user logging out. But under roots, let's just include logout. So we can now hit logout. Let's just echo log out. We'll give this a name as well. And we'll go ahead and update our navigation to include that URL. Like so. So we're all done. If we just log out, we just see log out. We're not actually logged out yet. So to actually log a user out is pretty straightforward. All we need to do is unset the session that we create. Remember our auth session is within config. So it's auth session user ID. So rather than manually put this in, we can just grab that from our config. Like so. And then we want to flash a message and redirect the user to the home page. So we say app flash global you have been logged out and then we say app response redirect and we want to say URL for home and that is it so now let's check it out if I click log out you have been logged out and we are in fact logged out